or twice daily. And we never close. Quick stop with 27 locations open 24-7. And yeah, welcome back. So we did have sunny skies through most of the day from our North Platte Tower Cam. If you look off to the north, you're going to see some clouds. These are from some showers and thunderstorms into the sand hills. We'll see if they can actually make it as far south as North Platte or Lexington. Currently at 98 degrees after reaching our high of 100 today. Winds south southwest around 10 to 20 miles per hour, and the dew point at least in North Platte at 59 degrees. So really not that bad. The uh, humidity is a lot worse as you make your way into our eastern counties. Temperatures look like this right now. So out toward Broken Bow and Lexington, cooler temperatures, but a lot more humidity into the lower 90s out in that direction. 98, your current temperature at Ogallala, Hyannis, and at Thedford. Here's a look at the wind still from a southerly direction. For most of us, wind speeds between 10 and 20 miles per hour. A little bit more of a westerly wind, a little frontal boundary where you're going to see those thunderstorms uh, between Hyannis and Thedford. And here's a look at the dew points around. So we do have that oppressive humidity. Dew point values out toward Broken Broken Bow in Lexington and points off to the east into the lower 70s. As is typical, we get a lot drier the further west you go. So let's take a look at the alerts that we do have. We do have a heat advisory in effect. This does include Lincoln County and points off to the east. That is tomorrow from 1 to 8 p.m. Central Time. And just issued, we do have a severe thunderstorm watch. This is from, uh, say, the uh, Mullen, Thedford area and points off to the east. It does include North Platinum does include Lexington. I don't know if the storms are going to make it this far south, but we think that as you make your way, say, from Broken Bow, from Ainsworth, points off to the north and east, this is the area just out of our viewing area that should get some severe thunderstorms. So that's why that watch is in effect. Here's where we're looking at right now with some storms between Tryon and Mullen, moving off to the south southeast. Nothing even strong outside right now. We definitely don't have any severe thunderstorm warnings, but we're going to keep our eyes on this slide. Line. Uh, it, the way that the track they're on, it should miss North Platte, Lexington, maybe Broken Bow could be uh, in line for some strong to severe storms. We think most of this is going to stay north and east of our viewing area as we make our way through later on into the evening. So other than that, we do have high pressure just off to the south, giving us that strong southerly flow. A low is missing us to the north. Uh, a warm front is making its way through, and uh, we will keep another frontal boundary coming through for tomorrow. So there is another chance of some showers and thunderstorms. So here's the sky cast for later on tonight. It shows those storms moving off to their east. So they're basically going to be from Broken Bow and Ord and points off to the north. Don't think it's going to be that big of a, a, an issue in our viewing area. Temperatures uh, falling back to the 70s and make our way through the rest of the evening. For tomorrow, more of the same. Some storms mainly to our western counties in the daytime heating. High of 104 in North Platte. And then as we go through later on, we will have uh, temperatures uh, near 79 degrees as we make our way through the overnight uh, for uh, Tuesday and into Wednesday. So let's take a look at that weather in motion. So we will have uh, this low to our north, another frontal boundary with the chance of some showers and storms as we go through the day tomorrow. And then more high pressure does work its way in as we uh, go through later on into uh, the week. Uh, still a strong southerly flow, so temperatures will get up there. Let's take a look at that extended forecast and as we make our way through Wednesday and Thursday sunny skies temperatures into the mid to upper 90s near 101 on Friday mostly sunny and then we get back to the 20 to 30 percent chances of some showers and thunderstorms Saturday Sunday and Monday but temperatures on their way down falling from 97 on Saturday all the way to 89 for the day on Monday Kent but still very warm for uh, quite a long time here yeah, about 15 degrees above average for this time of year. All right, thanks so much, Justin. In western Nebraska, the National Guard is now assisting firefighters in battling the 13,000-acre wildfire just southwest of Garing. Emergency management say lightning sparked the fire Saturday evening. Last night, state troopers worked to evacuate people in the area. So far, Region 22 emerged.